for a company, for the organization, there's a couple of things we need to think about. We have to think about personal ethics. So the actual moral values of each individual. We have to think about the culture, the ethical culture of the company or the national culture of the company. If you live in a country where corruption and bribery is happens every day, we will have different ethical thresholds, right? So culture, very important. The, the ethic position, the ethics values of senior management. Why? Because they are showing the example from the top. So if they have poor ethics, surprise, surprise, the employees below them will also have poor ethics. We will have maybe a corporate code of ethics, which we'll explore a little bit later. And lastly, the one that you should be most interested about, professional ethics, because the ACCA has its own ethical code. Right, it's called the ACCA code of ethics. And you should know this one very well. Now, the components. Let's think about components of ethics, or usually what you would find in a corporate code or in senior management code of ethics for the company. They're usually very similar. You will find things like openness, Companies open, transparent, and gives all the information to everybody, access to everybody. Trust, honesty, respect, accountability. What's the difference between accountability and responsibility? Responsibility is, it's my fault, so I will fix the problem. Accountability is, it's not my fault, but I will fix it. So that's why you hear politicians always use this word accountability. They never use responsibility because it was never their fault. Oh, it was the previous politician who made this mess. But I will fix, fix it. I am accountable, right? Do you think of, if we think about this uh, three-dimensionally here, we have two levels. And thankfully in BT, it's not that complicated. It's pretty bare bones. We have a compliance. Based level. And an integrity based. So. Already you can see integrity is going to be the best one. Because compliance is just. Obey. The law. Right, don't go further than that, just comply. Integrity, you're trying to go above the law. And you can also mention things in components, things like whistleblowers. Have you ever seen this word? Somebody who blows the whistle inside from inside the company and shows a fraud from within there should be a process to allow whistleblowers to come forward 